with Quinn Buckner. I'm Chris Denary. We represent the NBA and the Indiana Pacers and are glad to be with you for the second <laughs> game here. We have the good fortune to go to visit uh, with the NBA Cares, an orphanage. Oh, oh look at Victor. Oh, Victor gets the first hoop on the lob off the bat. Just that fact. They haven't played together, but you, you, as we continue to watch, you'll see the talent just come out. <laughs> It'll just come out, guys, and make great plays like Kimball Walker, a lot of. Here's Walker. He got it from his all-star oh, yeah. teammate Lowry and Courtney Lee for three. Ten-year NBA veteran and an early 5-2 lead for Team World. The alley-oop, it's knocked away by Cousins. Capella gets it back. <laughs> Something about who he is, but it's a big year for uh, the, the Pelicans, New Orleans Pelicans. That's a basket by Emmanuel Moody. Who well, a couple of years ago joined us on this telecast across the world. He was injured. Now a member of the Toronto Raptors and hits the three. And, and that's what he really got better at, Chris. Walker for three. And Kimball Walker hits the three-point shot. This is, this is a horse shot. Oh, you got to make that. It's a horse shot. Capella the offensive rebound. Nowitzki in the way. Down the lane is Moutier. Moutier, and now they have it back. Team Africa knocked away. You see the athleticism of Cousins as he leads a five-on-one break. Watch this. I mean, that, that's the size and the agility, and that's what the weight losses help him do. That's what that was. Now Moutier center of the floor, and Emmanuel Moutier with two more. See, I like, you do, let me tell you, that little move there. Will play for the first time with the Utah Jazz after three years in Atlanta, and here's Kemba Walker. Laying it in. Then he wears number six. And also CJ McCollum out of Portland missed the shot. Rebounded by Cousins <laughs> and put back in. And my Mute tried to block him out and just couldn't hold it. I'm just cuz Cuz is having fun. This is he loves the play. Does not get the roll, and Cousins has another rebound. A tiptoe rebound, by the way. He never moved. Lobs it up to Porzingis, and oh, he got it! Oh, my goodness. Now, that's terrific. That guy, ladies and gentlemen, I'm, this is one of the coming stars in the NBA. The ball is tipped in the air. Now, body control, athletic ability, the ability to get it up to the basket. Jalen Brown is in, the member of the Boston Celtics for Team World, wearing number that? seven, and that's a seven-foot-three guy making that one dribble move as Kristaps Porzingis with that dribble move That's a hits the move. jumper I think this is one of the more underrated players in basketball it's CJ McCallum Andre <laughs> Drummond we saw him working on that three-point shot during the week. game with Golden State having done what they've done to the game knocking down threes Andre Drummond who's a terror around the basket well there's there's Schroeder shake and bake that is outstanding and here's Schroeder Unafraid of 7-3, shot blocking Drummond there. One-handed, able to get it. You know, we watch some BWB players today, basketball with our ballers, you know, and guys that have been through the BWB program, Chris, what they talk about as Porzingis brings it back, and Jalen Brown takes it to the hoop, is the fact that they now can share their experience. Rondé Hollis Jefferson, who's in for the first time, will start his third year with the Brooklyn Nets, and he hits the shot and draws the foul. Dennis Schroeder got him on the arm. A little bit last year when he had Chris Paul on his team. Team Africa just one of 10 from three-point range as Drummond makes the shot. Number 50 in black from Tunisia. That's knocked away by Moody, taken by Brown. Three on one hello, break, hello, and that hello. is Andre Drummond. Andre Drummond gets one off the glass. Andre Drummond from Detroit to Johannesburg. Nice job answering on the other end by Mba Mute. Play international rules where it's up there. You go ahead and make it happen. And Moutier gets inside. Eight points. That's something that I think a lot of guys are learning from him as far as being patient enough to get to where you can be successful on the floor. What, what do you think this game means? You know, you 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 played here recently. Drain the three-pointer. So I, I think the sky's the limit for him. You know, as long as, as he continues to love the game and, and develop. Here in Africa is, is a big deal for, for guys. Team World trying to regain the lead, and McCollum has the basket. So he, he's feeling pretty good about it, too. Victor Oladipo has nine of his 11 in this second quarter as McCollum hits a long-range shot. 
Back to back years of averaging 20 points per game. Quinn, his first two years, a terrific pass from Oladipo to Capella. He'll start his fourth year with the Rockets in Houston in October as Oladipo takes it against Porzingis. That's why I did early. Boudier. Two on two break. Good defense by Lee. Yeah, got poked free there by Oladipo. Watch it. Oh. Oh. Oh, I thought that was going to be off because it looked like it was sliding right. DeMarcus Cousins, seven feet. We don't know what his weight is because he won't tell you anymore. Make that play. That's what, that's what Schroeder can do. Three-point halftime lead. It's Team World 50, Team Africa 47. We've got plenty more coming up. Our great teams, right. great players, and creating great competition. And, and by training more players, Africa, China, India, throughout the world, at back and watch basketball develop in a terrific way around the world. And it's happened largely through FIBA, our federation, basketball, they have their versions. But what we're not seeing really at a, at a pace that we would like to see are more NBA caliber players being developed. You well know from being in the NBA, I mean, shooting free throws in an empty gym is not how you become a great player. Even if you can hit 950 out of 1,000, you have to play against great competition. We bring together the top young men from all of Africa. So we have roughly 50 of the top boys, in essence, and, and around 30 of the top girls from all Africa. Front rims it into the arms of Moutier. And off the drive, it's Moutier all the way. We'll play against each other and sort of and start to get a feel for what it's like to be. We do, we've seen it at the league yes. when rookies come in and, you know, and even great college players. It's, sometimes it's hard to predict. The of the NBA is with us. Second NBA Africa game. Did it two years ago here in Johannesburg as Emmanuel Moutier scores on a regular basis with the Indiana Pacers during the NBA season. And there's Victor, Victor Oladipo again from three-point range. After having lost some of that weight. Courtney Lee has 13 points. He's hit three threes as Capella scores at a foul. Points per game, a career high. In the corner, McCollum. Good rebound by Kyle Lowry. <laughs> Look at it. Showing his guys he's got muscles. Small lineup on the floor. That's dribbled off the leg of Biombo, taken by Lowry. He'll shoot a pull up three. Oh, ho, ho, ho. Man, he's improved in that because that's, that's normally who they want to shoot it. Lob, oh, Jefferson, Thomas, oh, go get it. All is up. Now this is, I said they had a small lineup. The next biggest man they have, this is it. And he's only 6'7". A three-point world lead as we approach a minute to play in the third. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Footwork. That's the kind of expertise you learn. He's shooting that. All the deep ball. <laughs> he's shooting that. He, the way he's been shooting. Oh, what a heck of a pass. And for Zingas. This, this is the two bigs. Got to score on that basket because they've got big guys. Round for three. And Team World <laughs> has come out on fire yeah. to start the fourth. Listen, they got competitive. Now they've got a seven-point lead. Oh, my goodness. Brown. Oh, my goodness. What a shot oh by Brown. Oh, my goodness. Jaden Brown just made one up, ladies and gentlemen. NBA basketball gets to the rim. Biombo can't cover it up over his head backwards, softly off the rim. This is how you do it in the NBA. And now McCollum from three, rebounded by Moutier, running his Schroeder. Good decision. Right to the rim, and he scores against Porzingis. But you can see, watch what happens. This is a really good move at home. Watch him, he gets into the body of Porzingis. So Porzingis. A three-point team world lead. Drummond lost it. Oladipo out ahead, he pounds it down. Yeah, he's gonna get out and get in the break. That's Victor Sting, good hands there by Schroeder. Boy, everybody was on their feet here. Oh, they're on their feet. Oh, great pass by C.J. McCollum to get Porzingis running down the court. See this NBA talent. Yeah, without a doubt, Chris. And in, in, in that, oh, yeah! They got a lob on the backside, Porzingis to Jalen Brown. A Africa game here in Johannesburg, South Africa. We're at Ticket Pro Dome. Jalen Brown has had a couple of special highlights in this fourth quarter. Through three quarters, we had seven lead changes and 12 ties. And Drummond all alone. 
you need to have skill. Abaka was looking for the foul. Eight seconds to get it across the line. They don't. No. Moutier the steal. 42 to play. There'll be some boy or girl one day for after oh, this game. Depot. I knocked it down. Taken by Porzingis. Now, it got carved up because Andre Drummond was back there. Lowry scores and a foul. <laughs> he tried to drive right into Oladipo. You can see he never stopped. Looking to gather the ball, gets 42 seconds to play. Got the mismatch he wants with Ibaka trying to guard his teammate in Toronto. <laughs> and Lowry gets the best of it. Tremendous showing here by Team World and Team Africa in the second NBA Africa game 2017. And to cap it, Jalen Brown. Put on a show. Chris, they put on a show. There's no two ways about it.